two might still be undecided. The good news about tonight, we got to hear from the three candidates on the ballot to be Vermont's next governor. But there was a lot of nuance in some of their answers, not always a lot of specifics, as you'll hear from just some of the topics we pushed these politicians to answer. Tonight's NBC5 gubernatorial debate got candidates Sue Minter, Phil Scott, and Bill Lee talking about specific issues from legalizing pot to cleaning up phosphorus in Lake Champlain, all very civilly. But sparks flew between Democrat Minter and Republican Scott when campaign commercials came up. Do you disavow the bobblehead ad? Uh, yeah, I, I think I, it's nothing that I would run. I think it's, I think it's terrible. Ms. Minter, do you disavow you the know, Planned Parenthood ad? What, what I can say is, um, Phil, welcome to my world. This has been well, happening It's for, been happening to me as well, months. Sue. Lee, the Liberty Union candidate, expressed sarcastic sadness that he has not been the focus of political attack ads, but he did have a thought on how to reduce carbon emissions. I'm definitely going to have... I'm a, not a fossil fuel guy. They call it a fossil fuel because they aren't making any more of it. I'm a biodiesel guy. I am a wind guy, but on a small level, on every power pole, on every side of the, everybody's house, they have two of them. Scott says as governor, he'd veto a carbon tax. I believe that this, is, uh, this will just ratchet up the cost of living across Vermont. I don't think that we can afford it. I'm not looking to do anything, anything that would raise the cost of living on already struggling Vermonters. And Minter says she's opposed to a carbon tax, but environmental legislation is needed on a larger scale. And I think it is clear that climate change is not just real, it is here, it is having an enormous effect on all of us. Let's remember the winter that wasn't last year. What happened to our ski areas and all of the businesses connected to them. And maybe one of the best moments of the night was how candidates would address population decline. We graduate 10,000 students from our colleges and universities every single year. What we need to do is provide affordable housing for them. We need opportunity for them. I also want to drive innovation in the four key sectors of our economy. Advanced manufacturing, high tech, and the green economy. That's the farm, food, and forest economy, and the renewable energy and efficiency economy. Free Viagra. You've got to have more population. I don't know how you're going to get 10% in a short period of time. but. And in a lightning round session about the question of bringing F-35 fighter jets to Vermont, Lee says he's not a fan. Scott says he's been all in since the beginning. And Minter did not directly answer the question, but expressed her support for the Vermont Air National Guard. Live in the newsroom, Renee Wanderlich, NBC5 News.